Hey guys, it's Ken from KBD Productions TV. Welcome back to another Kendomic food review just for you. I am at an en route in King City. This is like a rest stop, gas station, multiple restaurant location just north of Toronto off the 400. And they have a place in here called Big Smoke Burger. And I stopped here like about six months ago and I had their uh, lamb burger. And you don't get a whole lot of lamb burgers up here in Canada. So I thought I'd drop in, give the lamb burger a try, let you know what I think of it. And uh, we'll be right back. Hang on, I gotta go inside. It's not a drive through at this point in time. So I'll be right back, hang on, bye. Woo, there we go. So there's another fail for a Ken Domic food review. They don't sell the lamb burger anymore. I was completely shocked. I'm looking at the board and I'm like, where is it, where is it? I asked the guy and he says that this wasn't a good selling item. I'm gonna put my seatbelt on because this is a big meal. I'm gonna go crazy. So I opted for their signature Big Smoke Burger and it has a horseradish mayo, caramelized onions, smoked cheddar, tomato, and lettuce. And it came to 775, uh, the fountain drink, your American's gonna freak. 229 for a freaking, that's 229 guys. So I have a new rating system. Just thought I'd let you know, there's the, the burger, I mean the bag. There you go, check that camera. Camera one, camera two. So they have a new rate, I'm ha I have a new rating system thanks to one of my awesome subscribers who said the one to 10 rating uh, is too complicated and plus I'm rating everything really high. So he said I should divide it into four sections. Uh, never again, indifferent, uh, amazing, you know, must try. And then the last one is you gotta get one as soon as possible. Okay, so that's my new rating system which is awesome for, for thinking of that way of doing it. So those fries are heaping fries. Big, lots of fries. Okay. We got some bonus fries in the bag. We'll eat those later. There we go, you stayed. So let's check out, uh, I always have to look at the thing. Big Smoke Burger, I don't know why, it's just a, my brain doesn't want to say it that way. So there's those golden, super golden fries. Check it out, ladies and gentlemen. Pretty golden. So let's give this a shot. They're not hot. They taste good though. Not too much salt. Hmm. Not a bad fry, almost similar to those really good fries that you can get like a Carnival's and uh, places like that. Hmm. Pretty good fry. Their drink was, uh, I got a Coke and it was pretty good. I think it had the right fizz and the right taste. Some places you go to and the coke tastes funny but that's a good coke so let's try this is the first time i've ever had this burger ever and i'm doing it just for you so let's give it a look see see what it looks like oh i'm we're actually really lucky because the last couple days have been like minus 27 degrees celsius which is i don't know I don't know, minus 10 degrees Fahrenheit, I don't know. And uh, so doing these reviews in my car is almost impossible. So uh, so it's actually not nice and mild out. It's only like minus eight. <laughs> so here we go, ladies and gentlemen. I can't see the the burger yet or the meat. It's hidden under this, underneath this ginormous bun. So let's take it apart just a little bit. So two small tomatoes. There's the mayo. What kind of mayo was it? It was the horseradish mayo. Uh, big, huge chunk of lettuce, that's good. And then they got this, uh, what kind of cheese was it again? Holy crap, my brain's gone. Smoked cheddar, horseradish mayo. So there's my smoked cheddar, I'm gonna have to flip it to see what the patty looks like. 
They're all six ounce ounce patties. That smells really good, guys. Oh my gosh. Horseradish on a burger. I don't often do that combination, but it smells good so far. Because I put horseradish on my roast beef and stuff, so why not put it on your burger? Give it a shot. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. We are going in for the big bite of the Big Smoke Burger. I actually said it right. <laughs> All right. Sorry about the lamb, but it's too late. It's gone. So here we go. Oh. I got a good bite that time. I got a piece of the, the meat, the bun, the cheese, the mayo, horseradish mayo, the, the lettuce, tomato. That full combination bite of that was very good. At this point in time, I am rating it, uh, I guess if we're going from, from my right to left, your left to right, this is like never again. This is indifferent, meaning nah, it's okay. I'll never buy it again. Where this one is, it's really good. And I would definitely buy this again. Should you drop what you're doing and go out and buy it right now? Bring your own pop. <laughs> or buy this for $2.29. I can get a two liter bottle of pop at no frills for $1.81. I think dollar eighty-seven, and they're selling that to me for two twenty-nine. That's just ridiculous. Anyway, guys, there you go. Look at that. Look at that. Whoa, the bun starting to split, which makes it a messy meal. So, the meat is awesome. The veggies were fresh and crispy. The lettuce was awesome. I mean, the uh, the cheese. I never. I don't think I've ever had that kind of cheese before. But uh, I'm gonna finish this off and I'll be right back. Hang on. Well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That was the big smoke burger, big smoke combo. And uh, I'm gonna actually lower my rating now after the whole experience. The fries weren't hot. The bun fell apart, as I'll show you in the bloopers. And I was basically eating it in pieces by the end. So uh, I will say indifferent. If you guys, or sorry, this is the indifferent spot right here. So I'm indifferent. If you guys wanna try it, go ahead. Don't rush out to get it. Uh, I'm not sure why the fries were cold, but whatever. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, rate. Ding, 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 ding. And I will be going to uh, Pizza Hut very soon. I'm in talks with them because I want to actually do it in their restaurant. So I have to talk to the owner and the general manager and all that kind of stuff. But we're going to be doing a whole bunch of pizza reviews from Pizza Hut. So hang in there. Please give this video lots of thumbs up. And we will talk to you next time on Ken Domic's Food Review. Ken out. Boop. I bet that wrecked the microphones. What do you think? Big smoke. Big smoke bugger. Bugger. Okay, we're rolling. Here we go. So I am uh, just north of Newmarket. No, I'm not. I didn't shave. I look like a bum. I didn't shave, I look like a bum. So it is falling apart. Ugh. Shot one, it's been a while. Shot two. Gosh!